It wouldn't be Memphis without trying ribs, so I'm headed to Rendezvous where they're famous for their dry rub. I didn't really have big plans for today. I'm just trying to make it to Arkansas so that I can go to Hot Springs National Park this weekend. But I'm driving from Nashville to Memphis and I've never been to Memphis. They're known for dry ribs and fried chicken. I honestly don't know very much about Memphis. I know that it's where Elvis recorded his first album. There's a lot of history with rock and roll and blues. It's also where Martin Luther King Jr. was shot. So there's certainly a lot to see and I don't want to miss it. So instead of driving on to Arkansas, I am going to stop in Memphis for the afternoon. It's almost lunchtime. So I'm headed first to Rendezvous for their famous Memphis dry rub ribs. Let's talk about those ribs. When someone mentions Memphis barbecue, I think of dry rub ribs because I've never been here before and I've never had them. So they cook the ribs on a charcoal smoker, which I asked to see and they open it up so I can look. And then they do a vinegar mop and they sprinkle the seasoning on top. So it's not really a dry rub. It's more of a sprinkle, but it's a dry seasoning. It was so good. You could tell that the cook on the ribs was already awesome. And then to add their seasoning on top, it was, it was the best. Well, every time I see the sun, a rooster crows for day. And every time I see that gal, she always looks away. Hell, she always looks away. Hold on. I can't believe I got to see the ducks at the Peabody. You, you hear about that a lot, but I thought they were just there when they marched. The ducks are in the fountain all day. Crazy. Baby, just hold. It's extremely empty here in Memphis. You can tell how lively it could be in other years. It's also just like Thursday afternoon, so that's not gonna help anything. I'm on my way to the hotel where Martin Luther King Jr. was shot. It's one of the resounding things I think of and relate to with Memphis. So while I know it was one of the things I want to do while I'm in Memphis, it's really heavy to be walking towards the hotel and knowing that I'll see the place in person where someone took his life when we're still working on all the dreams and freedoms that he fought for. Then I heard him talk about it a long time. To be able to come here and take a few seconds and think about it is nice. After all that, I need to go back to the van and go across that bridge to Arkansas. totally headed back to the van but I stopped at Gus's fried chicken it was on my list but I wasn't gonna stop it because I just had ribs but it is famous fried chicken and I just happened to be walking right by it so I got an order to go this is just one of the first stops of so many so if you haven't subscribed yet make sure you click that button I will see you in a few days in Hot Springs Arkansas you have to see this chicken
Obviously, it's crunchy. It has just a little bit of heat, but not much at all. Oh, it's so good. Oh, that's heaven.